I'm Patty O'Connor. I am the town crier for uh, Central Frontenac. I wear feathers and I wear lace and there's not many people in Central Frontenac that will do that. I live in Tishborn, Ontario, a small little hamlet. I retired here in 1992. I was born and raised in Caperell, Ontario, which is north of Sudbury. I've had the good fortune of living the military lifestyle. A lot of it is tough, but what goes with the tough is the opportunity to, um, you know, to do many things that hardly anybody has the opportunity to do. My years uh, stationed in Kingston, um, I got to travel up this way quite a bit. The people were so nice and I thought, well, you know, I haven't been any place in the world that's any nicer. And I've been to a lot of places in the world, you know, that, that that I, 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 can t I can tell that this is where I want to be. It wasn't a city. It didn't have the mansions. It didn't have the attitude. It had comfort. One of my colleagues um, retired and went into real estate. He said, Neil, if you ever come across a place that's unique, let me know. So they got this listing here. So I, I came, I looked, I saw, I bought, I retired. So that, that's why I'm here, because of this beautiful place that I have. I have my own private lake. Uh, it is surrounded by landowners. Another thing about my property is that I have the black rat snake. Uh, it's on the endangered list. The lake itself is a spawning lake and it spawns for pickerel and the pickerel run up the creek into the lake and it goes beyond into other lakes in the in the community. Everybody is interested in coming to the bridge here and watching the, uh, the fish run upstream. And just going out on the lake itself in the pontoon boat, sit out in the middle of the lake, you bring a book and Bonnie brings a bottle of wine. Uh, we just sit and float and when we hit the shore we start to motor up and go to the other end and pick up the wind again. Watching the loons and you know and ducks and and no I mean it, it, it just heaven you know what's more tranquil to retire into than a place where you can put your feet up and you know and uh, you just enjoy it. We have a wonderful arts community okay like I'm involved with the uh, North Frontenac Little Theatre um, and I have been ever since I've I come here and we're sold out almost at every one of our productions were, were sold out and it also is the start of my being a town crier in the, in the community because I was, um, I, I played a part of Mr. Bumble in Oliver and Mr. Bumble is the town crier. I get an opportunity to travel around with the mayor and go to uh, all kinds of events and uh, be a part of um, uh, welcoming uh, visitors to our community and things like that. Every event that you go to, um, there's always those kind of people that are there that, that are the life of that event. Even if it's going to a church dinner, there's somebody in the back kitchen, you know, who's, who's you know, telling jokes or laughing or giggling. And there's a lot of that that goes on around here, you know. I mean, that's country living for you. You know, I'd encourage anybody that's uh, my age, uh, and younger, of course, um, to come to this part of the world to uh, experience it, have a look at it, and, um, and and just see if it's different from other places that you've seen. I think you'll find that um, it's unique. For younger people coming looking for jobs and things like that, if they're prepared to travel a bit, to the, to the city centers um, uh, and live in the country, raise their children in a comfortable and safe and comfortable environment, um, ideal. Just a little bit of traveling involved, you know, and, uh, but for the benefits of it, uh, I think it's well worth it. We have a very special place here and um, if, if people are interested we are here with open arms to invite anybody that want to come to live in our community. I can guarantee you that it's not boring. I, I would say just come and uh, drop into the restaurant. Everybody will talk to you. You just ask questions and you'll know everything about our community in a very short period of time. Uh, ask for the town crier and uh, I'd be happy to bring you anywhere you want to go and show you, um, you know, the highlights of the community.